Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. In today's tutorial video, we'll be creating a Twitter like bot using Tweepy. Our bot will like tweets that contain certain keywords. We'll be using Python 3 for this tutorial and I'll be using Visual Studio Code as my code editor. But you can use any text editor you want. I'll be assuming that you already have Tweepy set up, but if you don't, then I've created a tutorial which you can watch by clicking this icon here at the top right of the screen. Or you can click the link in the description. Before we get into the code though, be sure to subscribe to the channel and like the video. And yeah, let's get started. So this will be the account that the bot will run on. Inside our project, I have the initialization code, which I explain in the Tweepy setup tutorial. The first thing we need to do is to create a stream listener, which will fetch all tweets that satisfy our future conditions. We can create our stream listener by creating a class called my stream listener, or whatever you want to call it, which will inherit from stream listener and override the onStatus method. We then add a parameter to this onStatus method called tweet, which will represent the tweets we find. For now, we can just print tweet found and then print the author and the text of the tweet. We can then create an instance of our class and call it stream listener. We can then create a stream instance and inside of the stream object we pass api.auth into auth and the instance of our stream listener into listener. Then we can call the filter method which will actually be responsible for finding our tweets. This first parameter we need to pass is called track and inside of it we need to pass a list of all the keywords we want to find tweets of. So I want to find tweets about Python as well as NASA. And the second parameter we need to fill is called languages and inside of it we pass a list of the languages we want to find tweets of. But for this tutorial, I'll only be interested in finding tweets in English. So I'll type EN. After this, we can actually run our bot. And if we wait a while after running, we see that the program picks up all tweets containing the keywords Python and NASA. We can now stop the script and make sure to actually stop it and not just close this panel. So to do this in Visual Studio Code, we need to click this button and then kill terminal. Or you can press Control C. Back inside of our onStatus method, we can check if the tweet is not a reply because we don't want to like tweets that are replies to other tweets. And we can check if the tweet hasn't already been liked. And if these return true, we can create a try and accept block and inside the try block we can print attempting like. And then to actually like the tweet we can type api.create favorite and as an argument the id of the tweet we want to like. Then afterwards we can print tweet successfully liked. Then in the accept block we can type accept exception as er and then just print the exception that we got. After this we should be able to run our program and after a while we should see tweets start coming in and we can see that the bot claims to have liked some so if I keep on refreshing this liked page we will also start to see new tweets that have been liked by our bot account. So yeah it seems like the bot works if you find any problems then please let me know in the comment section the bot will be available on github. Other than that though thank you so much for watching please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video and I hope to see you in the next one.